is that? Why is he built like that? There's so many characters to keep track of. Who is that? Oh my god. Dude, I need to get caught up. This looks awesome. Yo, what's up boys? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be reacting to every single opening in One Piece. Now, if you're new to the channel, um, I'm a Naruto fan. I grew up with Naruto. That's just been my favorite anime for as long as I can remember. Now, there's always been one other popular anime that I know people absolutely love that I never really got into, and that would be One Piece. I tried a few years ago, and I think I got into, like, Syrup Village with Usopp, and I kind of dropped it. I didn't find it very interesting. I picked it back up again, and I really started enjoying it, and I made it all the way to Alabasta, um, but then I kind of dropped off again. So I believe I've seen maybe two openings of One Piece so far, and I would love to pick it back up. If you guys want me to start doing reactions to One Piece on the channel, I would love to. That's something I'm really interested in doing, actually. But for the time being today, we're just going to react to every single opening in One Piece. Um, I think this should be a lot of fun. I'm sure I'm going to see a ton of characters that I've never seen before. But yeah, I'm super excited. I can't wait to see what One Piece has to offer in all 24 of these openings. Uh, you can see the video is 55 minutes long. Jeez, okay. Well, uh, without further ado, let's go. Wealth, fame, power. Yep, this is number one. Oh, I didn't think about this. These are all going to be the Japanese ones. I'm not sure if there's English variations. I kind of think there are. But yeah, these are going to be the Japanese ones. The Great Pirate Era. Goldie Roger is really cool. I'd love to learn more about him. Also, something I'm really interested in seeing is the progression of the animation. Because this show has been running since goddamn 90s. And it's still going on today, so... We should see a slow but steady progression in animation, I think. <laughs> I mean, it's just a happy song. <laughs> Okay, also I have to say, Usopp is my favorite character. Oh, Buggy. I'm not sure if I recognize the other two. Maybe the Axe Hand guy? Oh, Arlong? Okay. They pretty much just did this opening for all of East Blue. Alright, opening two. This one is my favorite. I mean, I've only seen two, so <laughs> it's not much of a competition, but yeah, I like this one a lot. It's a freaking vibe, dude. Dude, it sounds like an 80s rave song. <laughs> Luffy's just got a big ass mouth. I guess everyone in One Piece does. <laughs> Huge mouth. Zoro the goat. Sanji's pretty cool, but he annoys me sometimes when he's just like constantly being a simp. I, I don't care for that humor that much. Nami's very cool. I like her a lot. Her backstory in Arlong Park was very cool. I think I knew those. That was the Giants and then the Candle guy. And then Shanks crew. I want to learn more about these guys. Because that's supposed to be Usopp's dad, right? Yesop, I think that's his name. Yeah, this opening slaps, bro. Okay, I don't think I recognize this one. So we are in new territory now. See, I don't know the girl. Oh, I do remember that. That's right where I left off. Nami uh, was like blowing her bubbles in that thing that Usopp made for her. Okay. That girl, I feel like she looks familiar with the black hair, but I don't remember her. I'm gonna assume she must join the crew. <laughs> Luffy's so funny. One Piece is just a wholesome anime, I like it. I wish it took itself a little more seriously sometimes, because it leans too heavy on like the jokes and gags, but when it's like emotional and like gets serious, it's phenomenal. Alright, opening four, if I'm keeping track rightly, correctly, rightly. What island is this? What arc are they on? There's an awesome treasure at the end of the sea. Oh, we're getting like 3D animation now. Okay. <laughs> oh, Smoker! Oh, there's some characters I didn't know. I love Smoker. Pretty much every opening so far is just panning shots of the pirate ship and everyone laughing. It's been the same thing for every opening. <laughs> Usopp. Sanji, Chopper, Pirate Chick, <laughs> and I want to see more of Shanks. Shanks is very cool. Is that Usopp's mom? Hello? Why were they using a panda to drag behind the ship? That was weird. Cool. I like that one. All right, on to five. Opening five. They all just falling from the sky? Damn, okay. Ooh, that's a cool transition. I like that. Mmm. 
I kind of like this song. This might be a vibe. Now they're like really going full 3D. That was like an actual freaking blender animation. <laughs> Big Chopper freaks me out. Chopper needs to stay, stay a little. <laughs> what island are they on? Doesn't look like they added any new crew members though. Oh, who are those people? Who is that? He has an ice power? Oh, that's cool. Oh, I'm excited to see these people. Ugh. Ugh. Another long nose person? Perhaps? Chopper gets a fight? Oh my gosh. Dude, I need to get caught up. This looks awesome. <laughs> that was a good one. That might be my favorite so far. This is number six, I think. Mmm. This is really upbeat. Smoker. Ace! I don't know who that is. Mihawk. Don't know who those are. Don't know. Shanks. I recognize some of them. Why does Zoro look so tiny? That was weird. Also, why is Nami built like that? The hell? Her torso is like the width of my arm. <laughs> what is that? One Piece characters are built so goofy, dude. The second I saw Arlong, I was like, what the fuck is going on? Why he built like that? Looks like we get a lot more fights. This looks fun. Was that Usopp? Who, what is that? And he's lobby, I've heard of this. Okay. Is that Mihawk? What happened to Usopp? What is he wearing? That man's mustache just comes straight out of his nostrils. <laughs> this is just the first one. Redone? Is the seventh opening just the first one? I'm kind of confused. I don't know why this feels nostalgic. I only started watching it like a year or two ago. But I do love that feeling. Yeah, this is just the first one again. Sanji's gotta have lung cancer by now. That guy always has a cigarette in his mouth. <laughs> Alright, so is this the real opening seven or is this the eighth one? Oh my gosh, that's the one piece. What? The letters are like spilled everywhere. Oh, that's so cool. Mmm. I like this one. Oh, we're also widescreen now. Look at that. And the animation just looks completely 3D. Damn. It's funny, like, they can't be asked to animate the boat anymore. So every single arc is just some landing on an island, huh? What island is this? You know what? Next we gotta do... Okay, Nami. Goddamn. Uh, <laughs> what was I saying? Yeah, I need to do a One Piece arcs tier list from what I've seen so far. Because I made it all the way up to Alabasta. Tell you what, I'll finish Alabasta. Mihawk is the goat. I'll finish Alabasta, do... uh a One Piece arcs tier list, and then I'll start doing reactions on the channel, if you guys are interested. <laughs> Bro. This is wholesome. You never get to see this in the show, though. They're always fighting and doing crazy shit, but they're never just kind of relaxed like this. What? Bro, Sanji. Now that they got two chicks on the crew, that man's probably can't even concentrate anymore. <laughs> He's way too horny. Alright, I lost track, but this is something. I'll, I'll keep track in the video when I'm editing, but I don't know what number this is now. Damn. Luffy's uh, gum gum fruit ability is so cool. Was that a meteor? We got a talking skeleton. I think I've seen clips of him on TikTok. <laughs> Who is that? Bro's haircut was immaculate. So at some point, Usopp trades in his slingshot for a, like a freaking three-pronged... I don't know what that thing was. I've been saying, why doesn't Usopp just get a gun? If he's going to be the long-ranged guy, give him a blicky, dude. Usopp the shooter. <laughs> it's funny, because obviously guns are like real in this universe, but he just uses a slingshot. <laughs> Damn, we got hella characters who I do not know. This is crazy. Are these all villains? Well, clearly Shanks isn't. He's just crushing Marines like that? Chill, dude. What I like about Marines is that they're not inherently bad. I mean, they can be corrupt, but they're just trying to keep the seas um, clear of pirates. And pirates technically are sort of the bad guys, even though we're viewing it from their perspective. They're the ones going to island to island stealing shit. Although Straw Hats don't really do that. Oh, so... Mm, Blue hair dude joins the crew. Cool. His hair is immaculate. Oh my god. 
Look at all that treasure. Is that the One Piece? Is the One Piece just a ton of treasure, or is it the friends we found along the way? Bro, they just keep replaying the first opening again. This one clearly has new animation, though. One Piece. Fans must have really loved this first opening, because they are milking the shit out of it. Oh, dang, we're going through every arc. Giants, Chopper's arc. I can't even see. It's moving so fast. Okay, now I don't know how many of those characters are. I saw Crocodile. That's cool. That was a cool shot. We are... They remixed the song too in this one. Oh, what is that pirate ship? Are they gonna upgrade or is this someone else? Who is that? Oh my god! Bro's built like a machine. And Luffy's got some sort of power up. Damn, okay. This arc looks fire. There's so many characters to keep track of. I... I can't with this. That guy looks cool as shit. Bro, his mustache comes out of his nose, I swear to god. It's just nose hair. <laughs> They've been showing Shanks a lot in these openings. I'm curious if he becomes more prevalent of a character. Because he's done really nothing from what I've seen. He's just kind of an enigma. Alright, are we like halfway through? No, we're not even halfway. God damn, there's so many openings. This show is so long. Ooh. Ooh, oh, hands down already the best song so far. I've only heard like 10 seconds. Okay, maybe not. This part's weird. Sanji. Chopper. Her name's Robin. And his name's Frankie. And his name's Brooke. Okay, I know their names now. That's helpful. Frankie. Well, Frankie's forearms look like Popeye. <laughs> and he's blinged the hell out. <laughs> looks like a G. And Luffy ate too much. Go figure. Their crew is big now. Look how many people they have. Mm. Some cool looking characters. That guy looks cool. I recognize the white haired guy. Don't know who these are. Yeah, this song's really good. Who is she? We get a female villain. That's cool. Oh, I'm just assuming she's a villain. <laughs> I think I've seen that blue guy before and on TikTok or something. I don't know who he is. His name starts with a J. Jimpei? Jimbei, I think. I know One Piece characters now. Luffy and his brother. Yeah, they did get a ship upgrade. Look at that. Looks a lot better now. Oh, Sanji's making something delectable. Frankie's like an engineer with Usopp, that's cool. Playing checkers, I don't know. Go, I think that's Go. Chopper and Brook, I think, are the musical ones, that's cool. What, what are you guys looking at? Who is it? Oh! Yeah, that's kind of scary. Damn, they love putting Nami in a bikini in these openings. <laughs> Damn. They know where their audience is. The tattoo on his back has that white mustache horn thing that the one pirate did. Oh, maybe it's a uh, white beard. <laughs> that did not fit. All these evil guys going, oh, like Hail Hitler, and they're like, yay! <laughs> yeah, that guy. This guy looks cool as shit. He gives off like Madara vibes. Oh, buggy pirates! Oh, shit! That's a cool opening. I like that one a lot. That was a good one. Gave a lot more insight into the story. I wonder if Brooke finds it offensive that that's their uh, flag. <laughs> Just the skeleton. He probably ate some like skeleton devil fruit or something. I feel like everyone has a devil fruit power. Ooh, the animation looks a lot better here. We're getting more modern. Are we halfway through? We are halfway through. So if the show ran from like 2000 to 2023 and we're here now, then this is maybe like 2010, if my math adds up. Um, he's still got that freaking compass, damn. No new characters, though. They've really only added two. At the rate they were going in East Blue, I thought they were just going to keep adding a new character every arc, but clearly they had to slow down at some point. There was too many arcs and not enough time for this many characters. But they're adding more characters in other ways, you can see. There's other pirate crews that we can care about, Buggies and Shanks and the Marines. And the Whitebeards, I think. And all these pirates. Like, who are these? 
No clue. They all look really cool, though. Are they on, like, an ice island? This is pretty cool. I wonder what arc this is. <laughs> oh, is this him and Ace as babies? That's cool. He even had a scar as a kid? It's funny how, because the origin story is he, like, stabs himself, right? Or something? I don't remember. Somehow he gets stabbed in, like, the first episode. It's cool seeing Mihawk a lot more. But what was I saying about a scar? Oh, yeah, he gets cut the shit up and he never gets any scars, but that little stab wound, he always has that scar there. He can heal everything except that. And One Piece must get really good. I can tell it's getting a lot better, just from the openings. Any new crew members? No. Same ones. Oh, I gotta sneeze. Oh, I hate that feeling. Oh, I need to sneeze, but I can't sneeze. <coughs> oh, thank God. Man, why is this so depressing? What happened? <laughs> what happened to Usopp? <laughs> my guy got fat as hell. What did they do to my boy? I like seeing these little baby version flashbacks of Luffy. Who is that? New character. Childhood friend. My question is why did uh, Luffy never join uh, Ace's crew? Was he too young, I guess? Somehow Zoro manages to wield ten swords now. <laughs> he's got that killer bee in him, where he's like holding a sword in every crevice of his body. Is that underwear? <laughs> like, I just casually pulled out some panties and was smiling. This seems so sad. What is happening? He's taking his own step forward? I don't know. Symbolic for something. I'm sure if I was watching the show, it would hit different. Nice. Oh, it was Frankie's underwear. <laughs> I did not realize that dude is just wearing freaking tidy whities Grand line. Red line. Interestingly enough, the reason I got into One Piece is I watched a video that was called, like, The Geography of One Piece. And this guy just, like, broke down all the different segments of the world and how, like, diverse it was. And I was like, holy shit, I didn't realize it was there was this much world building in the show. That is so cool. Oh, there's just, like, a goofy anime i didn't realize how like in depth it went and that's where i was like okay i gotta find out what this is about and that's when i first started and then kind of dropped off when the freaking meowbin brothers came out i was like this is cringy i can't but i'm glad i gave it a second try and i need to give it a third try not so much a third try and then i don't like it i just i tend to watch shows a lot and then kind of fall off i have a bad habit of not finishing shows and one piece is definitely no easy show to finish with over a thousand episodes Damn. Oh, this is a crazy fight. Jeez. Oh my god. Also, I'm noticing he has a big-ass scar on his chest. I think it's been there for a minute. I just haven't fully recognized it. But something happened to Luffy. His chest was freaking slashed open. To be fair, that happens to Zoro and Usopp, like, every arc. So, <laughs> Shanks only has one arm, right? Because it got, like, eaten off when he was saving Luffy. This is a good one. Okay, who we got here? Luffy? Yep. Hey, he does have a scar. Look at that. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That was really cool. It was almost like taking what's in the manga and bringing it into the anime with all the color. Okay, Zoro's tra <laughs> training regiments are crazy, dude. They're crazy. <laughs> when I saw him just, like, pick up a whole barbell with, like, six plates and just start swinging it... Like he's swinging a sword, I was like, okay. <laughs> this is crazy. Ugh, what are these things? It looks like the... I don't know what I was gonna say. I was gonna say they were minions from Despicable Me, but... That didn't make sense. Or like some Squid Game people. Ugh, who is that? Who is that? I knew, That guy's name is Flamango. Dull Flamango. I know him. Because someone commented on a YouTube video and said that Dull Flamango is cooler than Pain. And I was like, what? That's all I know. I don't know anything about him. That guy looks cool as shit. Oh, he's got a sword, too. Ooh, we got a new sword user? Notice, like, not many deaths in One Piece. Like, they keep adding to the crew, but no one really ever dies off. Ah, it's cool, but it never makes me kind of fear, truly fear that anyone in the story is going to die. I just would watch it just to see the adventure and see what kind of things they go on. But whenever they're in some sort of situation where it's like, holy shit, they could die... I never really fear for them. Now, people outside of the Straw Hats, maybe they could die. I don't know. Are those Legos? But yeah. I mean, I guess you could say the same thing for Naruto. But at least in Shippuden, they really started killing off a lot of main characters. 
That's uh, one gripe I do have with One Piece. It doesn't seem like they really kill anyone off. Could be wrong, though. But at least they don't kill off any main characters in the Straw Hats. Also, Usopp looked like a G. Bro had his hat like this. He was like, what's up? He had that Michael Jackson pose. Damn, everyone is dripped out. They all got gold jewelry on. Jeez. Also, Usopp looks way different now. Zoro has a scar in his eye. I think I didn't notice that either. So at least they take some pretty mortal wounds. Like, even if they don't die, Luffy's got, like, scars on his chest. Zoro has one eye. So, I know they're gonna go through some shit, at least. Which is cool. Usopp should have the most scars, though. Every single arc that man comes back fully bandaged from head to toe. His nose always broken, face swollen. And he's the one who has no scars. But he seems to be the one who gets the shit beat out of him the most. Usopp must have some crazy healing powers, man. He ate a freaking healing devil fruit, I swear to god. Also, this fight looks sick. They're always fighting marines now. I figured they'd be fighting, like, the villain of each arc, but it seems like they fight marines a lot in these openings. Maybe marines are becoming the villain, I don't know. I wonder how my boy, uh, Smoker's doing. That guy's got an Usopp nose. <laughs> got no subs, I have no clue what he's saying. I heard One Piece in there, though. Yeah, everyone is dripped out, jeez. I also like how they change their attire for each arc, because they need to kind of like blend into the island. I do like that a lot. Their character designs are not consistent, like other anime are. They're always changing. Flamango Man. That arc looks crazy. They're just like, in the freaking city of gold, I swear. Again, they're fighting the marines. Dude, they can't give the marines a break. This just seems unwarranted at this point. They're beating the shit out of the marines. Aw, oh, Luffy looks cool. That dude has boxes on his arms. What is up with that? Logo never changed. Oh, this looks like a small island. We're gonna do an arc on a little tiny island? That'd be interesting. Again, Nami's in a bikini every time, bro. Oh my god. It's so funny. Don't know any of these people. Dude, there are so many characters. And I thought doing a Naruto character tier list would be insane with every single character. One Piece has got like three times as much. Oh my god. There's too many characters to keep track of. I love anime like this where the world is so huge. Someone's gotta let me know in the comments whether anime are like this. Like, long running, huge expansive worlds, like tons of characters, and still like fundamentally a good story. Because I've heard Fairy Tale mentioned a lot, but I've heard people say that the story isn't that good. I need some long-running anime recommendations with just, like, cool world-building. This is also making me really excited to watch, because the story clearly gets crazy compared to, like, the East Blue arcs, where it's, like, very simple. Oh, he fights the Flamango guy. Who's the guy on the right? What was that silhouette? Was that Usopp? Still no new characters in the Straw Hats. Frankie is built like a unit. That dude's shoulders are the size of, I don't know, a beach ball. I couldn't think of anything big and circular. They got their own gravitational pull, though. That's what I should have said. <laughs> Look at them, bro. They are huge. Those are some massive shoulders, my guy. Buggy is still in the show. That's crazy. They've shown Buggy like every opening. My guy has came a long ass way. Dude, look at his neck. What happened to him? Why is he built like that? Every opening, bro. Every opening. <laughs> Elephant? Okay. I've been seeing this horn guy a lot. What happened to Chopper? Bro, everyone looks different. She Is she still using that stick from Alabasta? That's cool. And Sanji can put fire out of his feet? That's cool. Zoro still got it with the swords. Luffy has, like, black under his eyes. Damn. Who is that? Looks like Luffy gets some sort of cool power-up. He had, like, some sort of black sage mode type of shit going on. If As long as that was Luffy, I'm not sure. Could have been someone else. It's a good opening. Is that Sanji? Wait, how far are we? Are we towards the end? Okay, we probably got like five or six more. Their ship looks a lot bigger too. Chopper's hat is different. This is a more slower paced one. I like it though. I like seeing everyone happy. It's cool. But Sanji does not look happy. Dang, is this 
We must get like a Sanji arc. This is interesting. Is he on his Sasuke arc? Does he just go rogue? Become a villain? That'd be kind of cool, actually. Oh, Jinpei or Jinbei. I know him. Huh, this arc looks interesting. Who is that? <laughs> is that the villain? <laughs> Bro, my man Frankie never wears pants. Oh, those guys looked cool. What is this, like a circus? And is that Crocodile? What is going on? Dude, this arc must be all about Sanji. This is interesting. Oh my god, he's missing a tooth! Dude! Oh, I don't know what arc this is, but this might be my favorite one. Besides the villain, who the hell is that? Does Sanji marry Nami? What was that? No, that, that can't be true. That didn't just happen. Maybe that was someone else. Yes, we the superpowers? Is that what they're saying? <laughs> what? Okay. Interesting. Damn, now this is like a Naruto opening, just like running through all your flashbacks. Bro, she's still the villain? So many characters, dude. Oh, that guy looks cool. He reminds me of uh, Overhaul from My Hero. Like the scarf over his mouth. Damn, okay, the animation looks so much better now. Something changed between the last two openings. This animation looks gorgeous. Okay, so that's not Nami. Sanji must have found his girl then. Congrats for him, because he needed one. Who's that, Kaguya? Got a little bit of a crossover here. Damn, are his eyes swollen shut? Oh, the fights look so cool now. Yo. That chick looked cool. Damn, this villain looks sick. I don't know who this is, but he looks way cooler than this stupid chick with lipstick giant lady. Oh, he gets, like, locked up? Oh my gosh. Luffy gets locked up. That's crazy. This beat is so fast. Oh, Zoro looks so cool. He's got new, like, some sort of new drip. Almost like a kimono or something. Sanji looks like a ninja, bro. What? Their character designs are always changing. I love that. So creative. Oh. 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 This guy again. That guy again. I'm noticing... Recurring characters that I don't recognize who must be pretty important in the show. Damn, so apparently Luffy gets locked up. That's crazy. And he breaks out and fights this horn guy. He's probably like OP as hell. The villain and by now Luffy is probably super o overpowered. I mean at this point we're what like 800 episodes into the show like he's got to be cracked at this point. Yeah, look at him. Jeez. What is that? He's probably got like 20 power-ups by now. Yeah, he looks insane. Dang, yeah, everyone's wearing like kimonos and shit. Whatever arc that is, that looks so cool. The aesthetic of it was awesome. Now they're just fighting a literal dragon. Looks like the dude from Dragon Ball. There's just so many characters that have their own stories that it's insane that it all molds together in, a, in a, such a long running show that's been so wildly popular for so long. Props to the author. Zoro's got like that freaking bun, traditional Japanese style. <laughs> Who is that? Who is that? Bro, we got some weird ass characters in this arc. Not her again! Bro, that's been like six openings now. Please just kill her. Maybe she's a main character and not a villain. I don't know. That's crazy if she's still a villain at this point. Y'all gotta move on. This dragon fight looks crazy though. Also, I like how Luffy doesn't. He's not like Naruto at all on that. He like beats the shit out of the enemy and then he's like, you need to forgive for what you did because I forgive you. Luffy just like beats the shit out of them and he's like, actually, I'm going to kill you. And then keeps beating them up. No talk, no jutsu here. Just talk, no fists. Also, what is going on here? Do we have another opening? This is the first one again for like the fifth time. We're going to gather up all our dreams. Okay, they redid it again. They love just redoing that first opening, huh? One piece. Compasses only cause delays. Look at the lyrics now. If the dusty treasure map has been verified, it's not a legend. Oh, did the blue guy join the crew? Oh, that'd be so cool. Did Shanks' crew ever get involved in this story? I really hope they do. 
I want to learn more about them. All right. I think this might be the last one, right? Yeah, this might be the last one. All right. Final opening. Oh my gosh, look at the animation. It's gorgeous. Ooh. Ooh. That was some sexy fluid animation. Everyone's still like in their kimono outfits. So I wonder if this is still the same arc. Yeah, and it's still got the horn guy too. Seems like at this point, the enemies have been pretty consistent for a while. It's like an archer you kept changing uh, villains. But once you got to Madara, then he was just like the villain for like 300 episodes. It must be towards the end game now. Ace, nice. Mmm, this song is really good too. Chopper looks crazy. Jimbei, Jimpei, I don't know which one it is, so I'm gonna say both every time I see him. They're still fighting this dragon though. How long has this dragon fight lasted? Jeez. <laughs> My man's like Superman. He can just fly around now. I guess the blue guy does join. He joins the team, that's cool. Glad they have a new edition. After. Who knows how long? Like 500 episodes, I guess. Is that it? Oh, that's it! Wow. Yeah, I guess that's it. Wow, okay. That's awesome. Wow. I just watched One Piece for a goddamn hour straight. That's gonna be a long ass video to edit. Thoughts on One Piece. It looks really cool. It was fun seeing the animation slowly improve over time, and by the time we had the most recent opening, that was like amazing animation. It looked phenomenal. I guess I kind of spoiled myself in letting me know what characters clearly seem to be joining the crew, but I don't think that's a huge spoiler. I'm sure once the arc wraps up, you can kind of tell that they're gonna join the crew if they've been kind of a staple of that arc and have expressed interest in being a pirate. So that's not much of a spoiler. And besides that, I don't think I spoiled myself on anything. I know nothing. I just kind of absorbed a lot of characters and arcs and things that happen, but it doesn't mean anything to me. So that's cool. Yeah, I'm glad I didn't spoil myself at all because I do plan on watching more One Piece. Um, I left off in Alabasta, somewhere near the end of Alabasta. So I'll probably wrap that up in my own time. Yeah, that's about it. Make sure to subscribe down below if you want more One Piece content. Uh, smash that like button if you guys enjoyed. And that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed and you have a nice day. Peace out, boys. Bro, what actually is the One Piece? Someone tell me.